Hello, this is Cheyenne. Welcome to Cheyenne Reads and today I'm going to be doing the Reading Rush TBR and I just wanted to share you guys, share with you guys the books that I'm going to be reading for the challenge. The first one is read a book with a cover that matches the color of your birthstone. I was born in August so my birthstone is a peridot and I'm going to be reading The Desperation Road. I believe it's about a man who gets out of the penitentiary and on the way on the way to his hotel he sees a woman and her daughter and the and they need a ride they're sweating they need a ride to the hotel that he's going to be staying at anyways and a man ends up dead and they're the key suspects the woman and her child and so he has to decide between himself or them being the prime suspect and I just thought it was interesting. I picked it up from Dollar Tree and I really can't wait to dive in, but this will be one of the books I'm reading. The next book is read a book that starts with the word the. And I want to get into the city of brass because so many people have been recommending it. So many booktubers that I watch have been recommending it. And all I know is it's about the city of brass and it's a fantasy novel. And I would try to describe completely what it's about, but I just believe she meets Dara, Nari meets Dara, and it's about their tale. So we'll see what happens with this. But I'm really, really excited to read it. And this is my copy from the library because I need to say some money. But yeah, and then the next book is read a book that inspired a movie you've already seen. And I've already seen Twilight, so but I've never read the book, so I'm going to be reading the book for the first time. I think I read a chapter earlier this year, but I've never completed it, and I found a copy at the thrift store, so I'm going to be reading this. I'm sure everyone knows what Twilight is about, and I'm just excited to finally get into this book because it's been one of my favorite movies. I've watched the entire series over and over and over again, and it's on Amazon Prime now, so... Maybe I'll read this and then watch the movie, but I'm also going to be doing a vlog for the Reading Rush and maybe it'll be a week long vlog and I'll post it at the end and I'll just probably add some spoilers to the video and talk about how much I love these books or if I don't like them, we'll see. And the next book is read the first book you touch. So for this tag, I decided to put a book a pile of books that I wanted to read on top of each other and I set a 30 second timer and I just went up and down like this on each book and I landed on the Gone Girl. So this book is about a wife and a wife who goes missing and the husband who's the suspect I believe and I guess some stuff happens to him and obviously some stuff happens to her and I've heard a lot about this book so I really want to give it a read. And this is honestly the book that I wanted to choose because it's been sitting in my closet for a while now. And I'm like, gosh, I really need to read this and stop reading ebooks and stop reading other library books. But I have a mix of the two in this pile. And the next book is read a book completely outside of your house. And the next is read a book in a drawing that you've always wanted to read more of. So I live in Las Vegas and it's super hot right now. And I was like, okay, I noticed other people are choosing graphic novels or comics for the read outside thing. And so I was like, okay, why not get into Tokyo Ghoul? And a lot of people have recommended this on BookTube. And I, you know, wanted to get into it. So I checked it out from my library. And it says, Shai Ken Kaneki is thrilled to go on a date with the beautiful Rise. But it turns out that she's only interested in his body and eating it, that is. When a morally dubious rescue transforms him into the first half-human, half-ghoul hybrid, Kim must survive ghoul turf wars, learn more about ghoul society, and master his powers. So I'm super excited to get into this book, well this graphic novel, the comics or the, the graphics actually. The pictures look really interesting and nice and I love the art style honestly. And it was between this one or Uzumaki by Junji Ito that I was going to choose. And maybe I'll even do both if I can read. But my goal is to read like at least one or two books a day. I'm going to try to read this in one sitting, honestly. Maybe I'll pick up Uzumaki because I checked that out from my library as well. And the last tag. So I don't know if I said it, but I'm going to be reading this one outside because... 
it'll be fast and I don't know. And the last book, it says read a book that takes place on a different continent than where you live. And so I know Wicked Fox takes place in Seoul, Korea. And I know it's about a girl who turns into a fox and she kills men who won't be missed. And it's about their romance, her and Ji Hoon. I'm not sure, but I'm really excited to read this because this has been receiving a lot of hype on BookTube and I finally just want to get my, I obviously have my hands on it, I checked it out from my library, but I finally just want to start reading this and I know I'm going to love it because it's a contemporary fantasy and I'm just super, super excited and that's my reading rush and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you liked it and the lighting is better in this one than it was in my last video. I'm just so thankful for the few people who watched it and retweeted my tweet on Twitter and, you know, reached out to me and told me they liked the video or even just watched it. Just thank you and I hope you guys continue to watch my next videos. Have a good day.